Hello guys, Azuchio here. You might know me as the pilot that won first in Globals Apex Season 2 and just recently sees Apex Season 1. I got to pilot some very strong accounts and win, but never really showed off my own account. Since I get asked many times how much I spend and invest into my own account, I figured I'll show you guys now what I have achieved through my investments. So starting off with training here, my infantry training is quite trash here. Lancer is even worse. Cavalry is okay, doing just slightly better here. But I'm still missing some key troops here, like I don't have Heaven's Guard trained up. Flyers, well, my juggler is not going to have the best of troops here. Archers are slightly doing better just because of how much I love assassins. And the holy demons are not doing that great as well. Alright, so next we can look at all the heroes that I have access to. So these are all the 6 star my best units. Then we have a 5 star Elwyn here. 5 star Lestel. A D lit, that is 4 stars. This Leon is 5 stars. Mystery Knight is at 5. And then a bunch of other units here. This is really all I have for PvP. So, these units you see here, and then the rest below are completely unusable. This is a 4 star Leaden for PvE purposes. I only recently just got Wyler. Pulled one copy of Ares. Never really got anywhere with this here. So, 5 star Lana. And then everyone else here is unusable. Clara does not have Sigma for her attack bond, so she is quite sad here. And then this is 3 stars, oh, oh actually 4 now. This I pulled too many copies of him. These guys I never really use. And that's really it. The rest of these are level 60 and below. There's a 4 star Mega. Never really invested into him. There's a Mirage here. Alright, let's look at all the stuff I'm missing. So, I do not have Shelfaniel, Emilia, Illustrial, Betty, Young Jessica, Rainforce, Brenda, Akaya. No Gizroth, so Season 5 is going to be quite rough. Lambda, Sigma for Clarabons. And over here, put everything here. Missing these two guys. Missing Sumire. And missing Rene. I'm actually missing quite a bit of uh, equipment here as well. Never saw these two. No soul stealers anywhere. No Mimir hammer for Yusuke. Never got a swordsmith emblem. Balance blade, nope. No current readers. Never had an Astaroth here either. Alright, so that's for the summons on my heroes. Next we can look at how much I actually spend here. Alright, so I don't buy any crystals. Uh, the only gift pack here I bought is the Narm gift pack. And 20 bucks for an, an, a pair of Apex boots. That's it. Don't buy any of these. Never bought this runestone pack either. Now the only thing I do get is the monthly flag and clock. Don't even get this. Just don't feel the need to. Alright, what else do we have here? 
back off light so far it's zero this month and it's like this for every month so yeah with all this my account is quite poor here this is my box i have a bunch of units here for the backup box and that's all the usable units i have pretty much nothing for you know choices but what did i do what did i accomplish with all that in season one i made it to top 64 dying to lemons who eventually made it to second place in season two i made it to top 32 eventually losing to lux across lee that ended in top eight i'm not going to really count season three here ending at top 16 just because i barely played my own count for this season all right so with all that shown, I hope I can inspire some of you guys to get up and learn with me, get better at the PvP in this game. Of course, you will be at a disadvantage against better maintained accounts with all of the new PvP heroes, but you can still get very far with good knowledge of the game. And of course, lucky enough, so you can get into a bracket without all of the top players early on. All the videos in my YouTube channel are made to help you guys become a better player. The Summit Third Languister Season 2 will start in a day, and there might be more videos or streams soon. I am not even making any money off of these videos because of how little interest there is in these PvP videos. They don't get enough views, and I would need at least a thousand subscribers to start monetizing anything, which is quite difficult compared to others that make PvE guides. Now, if you would like to support me and get access to even more information not made public yet, I am offering paid private coaching lessons where I can share with you all that I know about Apex PvP, including building boxes with you, review matches to track your progress, and more depending on what you want. All the information can be found in my Discord, which you can find linked in the description of this video. So that's it for now. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.